I'm Alana Sigmund. I am a perioperative medicine internist here at the Hospital for Special Surgery, and I'm the director of the arthroplasty service. In my role as the director, I oversee a lot of the postoperative care of the arthroplasty hip and knee patients. So I attend rounds every morning, and I listen to whatever the issues are that are going on with patients admitted to the floor um, and try to smooth out any, any problems that may arise. My job is to evaluate patients prior to surgery and follow them after the surgery and make sure that there are no complications or issues that are arising. Perioperative medical care is very important. It really allows us to take a deep look at patients' medical history and medical issues that they may have going on and address any avoidable risks prior to surgeries. So the surgical patients that I typically see are patients who are having their hip and knee replaced, although I also see patients who are undergoing uh, sports medicine procedures like arthroscopy or shoulder procedures. Patients come in and we screen them for any issues they could have that could affect the safety of their surgery. We go over any risk factors that they have. Then after the surgery, we follow the patient to make sure that their care is proceeding smoothly and they're not running into any medical complications after the surgery. The team approach is very important. Uh, the internal medicine doctor is one doctor of many who really make the surgery as safe as possible. The surgeons refer the patient to us and explain to us what procedure they want to do. Um, we uh, relay information to anesthesia so that they can really uh, treat the patients optimally during the surgery. And uh, after the surgery, uh, we all relay our findings to pain management so that the patient is as comfortable as they can be after the surgery. HSS is a, a wonderful orthopedic hospital with a sterling reputation. Our surgeons are absolutely wonderful. Uh, we have an amazing uh, perioperative medicine department. We'll take care of you from two weeks before your surgery until after, and we're you know here to answer all of your questions. Patients who maybe uh, couldn't walk before the surgery, you can see them taking steps in the hallway as you do rounds. I mean, there's nothing really that beats you know being a part of that process, um, and more often than that, but equally wonderful is just patients who are in so much pain prior to the surgery. Tell me they feel great. They just have a little soreness. They can't wait to get up and get out of bed and walk with physical therapy. I mean, that's a real win, I think, for the entire team.